Yeah, so today we're off to um, Brer, I think it's called. Uh, but we're going to stop off and uh, look at the Mermaid of the North uh, on our way. Uh, there was another um, place we were going to visit called Kokoa Mountain Cafe, but apparently uh, it doesn't do Cadbury's uh, hot chocolate, so that seems to have put a kibosh onto that plan. Uh, but Brer has got a fantastic beach, and we know who loves a good beach, so yeah, see you later. So what was Tain like? Well, I mean, you walk down the high street and you see the impressive Royal Hotel. Uh, lots of clearly historic buildings and, and you get sort of echoes of a past of a busy town that there were a couple of shops that were had signs in the window saying they were permanently closed and it does look like a dying town. Having said that, there were quite a few notices about various projects and developments that they're planning, so hopefully that will bring back a bit of life to the town. Um, we came thinking, you know, we like a good town and walking around looking at the shops, but there was just nothing to really see. So um, there was Harry Gower's Bakery, which has been recommended uh, in our guidebook. So later on uh, today, I'll go and have a look and see what it's like when it's in full flight and operation, but most of the shops were closing at two, three o'clock yesterday. So yeah. Uh, hopefully it gets a bit more alive, um, but it only took us about half an hour to see everything it seemed that Tane had to offer, so yeah, there you go, keep smiling. So, a small minority of dog owners Give a vast majority of responsible dog owners a bad name. So I don't know how you're meant to eat these. So I've toasted them and put on a little butter. So let's give it a try. Tastes like a stodgy pancake. So. Let's see what Sammy thinks. Well, the chairman suggests he liked it, Sam. Was that good? of the north and the car
sort of the uh, of the Balintor. So this was designed by Steve Hayward. And it tells of the Scottish folklore story of a fisherman stolen away for his wife. All those skills you learnt in the pub are coming and can be used at the cafe. Controversial. And out there, we're hoping to see some dolphins. Can you see the seagull? How about now? There he is. <laughs> He's a noisy bird. Ah disappeared into his nest there and he's over there it's kind of like a reddish brown head isn't it I'll have a look and see what it is a lot of noise for a small birdie Gravitation water introduced into Port, Port Mahomac in 1887. What is gravitation water? Wooden cockapoo. Rows and rows of lobster pots. Are they having a stare off? Look at it. Can you see it? A little bit of wind now, so it makes it a bit more difficult to spot sea life. But we think we saw two or three seals. No dolphins. Okay. Sam, do you want to 
go beaching. It's not listening. Sam, you want to play ballies <laughs> on the beach? Come on in. Epic effort. I'm not sure I ever get in there. But that's what Sammy's going to be running that night for. What have you spotted, Sam? <laughs> <laughs> All right, then, come on. <laughs> Good boy. <laughs> I'm not going to fight too far out, ball maker. <laughs> Is that your favourite thing to do? <laughs> 